and a submarine. Do, 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 do. Submarine man. Do, 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 do. Anyway. I'm allowed to have fun. I'm allowed. Shut up. Okay, so here's my thinking. Now that we've learned some of the controls um, the first time we played a few weeks back, I'm thinking we're going to start anew, uh, given that I didn't really understand what I was doing when we first started. So we're going to go ahead and try this out from the the hop, as one might say. And uh, with any luck, this will turn into just oodles and oodles of fun. Okay, it just means I have to start from scratch. That's all. That's all. That's all I have to do, right? Do you know what I'm um, I think I'm gonna start with subs. I think starting with subs is the best way to go here. I'm gonna go ahead and get a tambour. Um, we're gonna call this um, call this uh, recon sub one. Done. Let's go ahead and set a course right on up here. Actually, let's go near this first. Say there, then there, and then there. Cool. Alright, that one's gone. Let's go ahead and get another Tambor sub. Uh, hello? Select- oh, I gotta click the thing again. My bad. Get another Tambor. Oh, I have to- Jesus, that's annoying, isn't it? I gotta- okay. Okay, that's fine. I'll just- <laughs> I'll play a long little game, that's okay. We'll do our thing. This is the Tautog. I like that name, actually. It's pretty cool. This will be Recon Sub 2. Recon Sub 2. Now she is going to go right up along this wise. Go here. And then here. And then here. That's what we're going to do there. Alright. Got it, got it, got it. But here's the thing. I'm thinking we split it into two groups. Um... I think I want two C two C threes and an oiler in each group, and that way I think we're gonna try to populate Renell and Santa Cruz not simultaneously but very very close to each other. So let's go ahead and grab a merchant ship. Um, let's get a C three. Uh, let's get a second C three, and I need an oiler, which it's gonna be very difficult to to call it an oiler. I'm not used to that. Uh, phraseology so this gets me troops supplies oil and i'll come back get more troops and uh engineers that's the plan there okay this is going to need protection let's go with a i'm considering like two light cruisers and two destroyers here i think that might be the way to go for both sets because then i can afford everything um which one did we like we didn't actually check to see which one of these we liked. We didn't look at light uh, light cruisers last time. The Brooklyn. Ooh, I like the Atlanta. Ooh, the Cleveland has some excellent anti-air. Excellent, excellent. Uh, no dual-purpose guns. There's the Brooklyn. There's the Atlanta. The Atlanta does. The Atlanta does have dual-purpose guns. She doesn't have terrible anti-air. They very rarely come at you from the nose. I like the Atlanta class. I do. We're going to get two of those. Two Atlantas. Uh, destroyers, destroyers. I like the Farragut class, to tell you the truth. The Porter is a little tighter of AA, but I need them to be more spread out, I think, honestly. I think that's the better way to go. Plus, she's got dual-purpose guns. I like that idea. Okay, let's get two of those. Um, so this is going to be... Um, I don't know. Uh... Replenishment at C group one. All right, let's go ahead and figure out how we're going to set these guys up. Let's see, circular. Can we do circular? I could put light, light, destroyer, destroyer, all the goodies. Mm, don't really like that idea. We might just go line ahead to tell you the truth. They're easy to track that way. Line of breaths, no. Two column left. I think maybe two column left is going to be the way to go here. Three, oh, three columns, definitely different. What if we were to put the... 
Let's switch the Atlanta for seven. So we've got a light cruiser back here. Let's get destroyers at two and three. So the Farragut at two. The Juno is a destroyer. Farragut. Um, oh, the Dewey. The Dewey is another destroyer. So two, three. Got to swap them with this guy. Okay. So it's C3 in the middle. Destroyer to either side. I'm going to want the oil tanker as number four, and that works out perfectly because it is. The Juno is five. We've got a C3 on this side with the Atlanta bringing up the rear. I kind of like this one. This is good. I think this is good. Okay, let's go ahead and manage cargo for this C3. Um, manage cargo. We're going to take troops. This is going to be my troop C3. Let's do that. Uh, cool. Now, the next C3, this guy here, let's go ahead and get his cargo up, we'll go with supplies. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay, cinema on. Do I have to actually fill that up with oil, I wonder? Phew, I do. I do have to fill it up. Amazing. Okay. You would think that an oil tanker would just like, okay, but whatever. No, I get it. I get it. I get it. All right. That is Raz Group 1. She's our landing party, essentially. Actually, let's call it that. Landing Party Alpha. Landing Party Alpha. That is what this thing is going to be called. So Landing Party Alpha is going to go straight for um, the Rennell Islands. That's the plan. We have 97 points left. So that took me 103 points to build. So our next uh, run won't be as beefy, unfortunately. New C. All right, same idea. We want two C3s. Two of those guys. Boop, boop. I want an oil tanker. Boop. And I think this time we're going to go with um, one light cruiser and three destroyers, if we can. So one light, cru light cruiser. Which one did I take? The Atlanta last time? I like the Atlanta. Let's take that. So it costs 35 of my 97, brings me down to 62. 62, 52, 44, maybe? No, da, 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 da. Okay. I think we can squeeze in a few destroyers here. I think maybe three. Uh, let's go ahead and take Farragut's. That's fine. One, two, three. Perfect. Okay. Great. This is going well. All right. This is going to be... Um, Landing party. Bravo. Cool. I'm hoping that this will pr will prove less of a problem for me, realistically. All right, so we'll have the C3 in the middle as per chat's instructions. I'm going to go ahead and swap number five to the two position. Three position is going to be the San Diego. Um, I want C3 at 5, C3 at 5, 6 is a C3, and the Warden is a 7. Okay, this is probably the best I'm going to do here. Alright, C3, let's go ahead and get uh, troops to start, and we'll go with the Cinnamon, Cinnamon, Cinnamon. Fuel, good. On uh, our second C3, let's go ahead and manage cargo. And we'll get supplies. Good, okay. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And this is landing party two. We're going to head for, I can't even remember what this is called. Santa Cruz. Santa Cruz Islands. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, let's keep on keeping on and see what happens. Landing parties are heading out, along with some submarines. Spotter aircraft, that's not good. Means we've got ships in the area, no light more than likely, or possibly a sub. Could be a sub. What do I know? Alright, unload cargo. Fantastic stuff. Okay. Santa Cruz is now under my control. However, I need more stuff to build shit, Right? So I need <clears throat> engineering. I need engineering to build stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and send landing party two back 
to New Hebrides, I believe it's called. Landing Party Bravo, that is. And uh, we're going to get some more junk. Get some more stuff. Let's do that. Boop. 21 hours. I like it. I like it. All right. So far, so good. Spotter aircraft again. Either there's nothing out here with us or we're too tough and they don't want to take us on. Probably not the latter, realistically. It's probably not the latter. All right. Let's go ahead and unload on Rennell Island. Let's do this. Unload all cargo. Uh, am I not close enough? Really? Okay. I mean... <laughs> sure, I guess. Uh, no, I'm, I'm literally not close enough. Okay, my guy. You're the man. You know what you're doing. I don't. Right? There we go. Get in there nice and tight, ladies and gentlemen. Snuggle on in to Rennell and uh, unload my stuff. Booyaga! Okay. Rennell is now under my control. We need more stuff. We need more things. Gotta build up our forces, people. Uh, can I click on Alpha? Yes, I can. Let's set course for home. Essentially, go pick up some more junk. Recon Sub 1. I'm wondering if I want Recon Sub 1 to just be patrolling. No, actually. Actually, we're gonna change your course. Uh, let's have you, um, patrolling here, I think. Yeah, let's have you patrol this area. That way, if any nasty people come around that side of the island, we'll know about it. And Recon 2, let's change your course, please. Let's have you head here. And start patrolling this area. Just like this. Yeah. Don't want to be taken unaware, people. Nice. That's my plan, everybody. That's my plan. The encounter with Recon Sub 2. Does it tell me anything about it? Well, we can see some boats. We got boats, people. Let's figure this out. We got boats. Um, can I... Let's go to Silent Running. Let's go to Periscope Depth. Yeah. And we'll go ahead and start that up and see how it looks. Um, are we already at periscope depth? Perhaps we are. Okay, scope up. Uh, we're going to go ahead and slow right down to five knots. How do I... Okay, pause is this. Okay. Um, where is my targets? Ooh, they're just leaving port apparently. All right, why don't we go ahead and navigate in this direction a little bit. At five knots, we'll go scope down for the time being. And we'll uh, see what we can do about this. Turn a bit. Um, can I? Yes, okay. I can move this map, excellent. I'm going to go ahead and take aim at the middle target here, which apparently is a destroyer, I think target that ship. Start building a solution on it. Get ready to rock and or roll. We've got... Where's my solution at? Uh, solution is 27, apparently. 27. Torpedoes, please. Um, okay, so my target is second in line. You've got one. Ooh, it's like a heavy cruiser or something. That guy... This guy, right? This is my target here. All right, let's start with Terra Ryu. Terra Ryu, one, two, three mass, tall superstructure. T ten, ten Ryu. All right, I'm going with a ten Ryu. That's what I'm saying it is. That is my choice. How do I lock it in? There we go. There we go, locked in now. Cool. 47% solution. It's not great. Let's go with a full spread, whatever we've got. Uh, let's go like maybe two, no, let's go three degrees of spread, maybe. Something like that. See if we can get better than 50% on this. Starting to lose the angle, though. A little worried about it. 47. I think we're just going to be firing, to tell you the truth. Yeah, we're losing, oh, 48. Mm, we're firing at 48. Are they firing? 
Yes, okay, we are firing, good. All right, tubes away. Let's go ahead and uh, accelerate to speed five in this direction. And we're gonna go a little deeper, I think, down to 200 feet. I'm assuming I can go to 200. I mean, it looks like we can go pretty damn deep. Let's go, I don't know, let's go to like 100. Let's go to 100. Um, silent running again, please. Repairs and reloading halted. Okay, cool. Um, so here's our buddy. Here's our pal. This is our target. Okay, let's see if we smush him. Let's see if they get smushed. Um, given the amount of spread I gave it, I would expect only two to three torpedoes could possibly hit. And given that these are Mark 14s, this is going to be horrible. These are basically all going to be duds. There they are, there. Hey, Turpidus. They're right there. Just hanging out, doing Turpidu stuff. They look like they're way, way off target to me. Then again, I, I don't know what I'm doing yet, so... Meh. Whatevs. Whatevs. See, I always thought that they, like, turned into target in this game. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's, like, later. Maybe you have to upgrade your torpedoes or something. I don't know. How we doing? Well, it looks like we're gonna hit something. 14 to T1. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Oh. I don't know if any of these are actually gonna hit our target. They might hit other um, ships, though. I think really only this one has a chance, and not a great chance. Uh, maybe. This is cool. I enjoy this. This is fun. It's weird to not set up any solutions, though. Like, you don't set them up yourself. It's very... kind of wild. I don't know if we're gonna hit this thing at all. We might have missed absolute... We might tag it with one. Maybe. Oh. Yeah! 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 Alright, the light cruiser is on fire. We've got uh, several running torpedoes that are not going to hit jet. Well, maybe. This guy's turning in the wrong direction. We could tag this guy in the long run. Maybe. Depends on how well he is at evasion. Yeah, our light cruiser friend is burning up, my guy. Burning up. Uh, one dud? Yes, because I only see four uh, trails now. Yeah, I don't think any of these are going are gonna to hit. This guy's way too fast. Now, that destroyer back there is probably heading for us. So let's um, go away. Uh, I don't want... Break. Navigate out. Um, six knots at 150 feet, maybe? Maybe that's a thing we can do. Yeah, these are all going to miss... Um, it's possible, not likely, but possible they could tag the, <clears throat> what I assume is a heavy cruiser here. She's awfully fast, though. The light cruiser back there is still burning. She's not having a good time. That was indeed a ping, my guy. We're turning, trying to get these guys out of our baffles into line of sight. Thereabouts, anyway. Oh, they've lost us, look. They don't know where we are. <laughs> Very good. Although they are going in the correct direction to find us, which is less than ideal. Less than ideal, everybody. Cheers. They're on top of us. How close are they actually? Right above us, as far as I can tell. Maximum reverse. Maximum reverse. How fast are we going? Where's my readouts? Where's my readouts? Speed is three, two. Maximum back. Maximum back. Hey, a hype train is close. Fantastic. Easy, boys. We gotta get out of Dodge. She's got hedgehogs. She's turning above us. Doing four knots to the rear. Last of bomb is in the water. One over here. One over here. <laughs> Much obliged, man. Much obliged. Oh, this is squirrely. Squirrely, folks. <sighs> close. They're close. Uh, check damage. So far, so good. So far, so good. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh. Four knots forward. All right, how we doing? All right, she might have lost me. She's going the wrong direction. Number five is not going the wrong direction. Kill the motors. Kill the motors. All right, this guy is coming right across my bow. Might have to pull that same trick. Can we go to 250? I don't know what the maximum depth is for this sub, by the way. Don't have a goddamn clue. Oh, I'm, uh, I think we should slam on the, the gas. I think we should try to get out of dodge. I think we should, we, should, we should try to get out of the frigging way is what I think we should do. Try to get out of the way. Whoa! She's going right over. There she is there. Oh, this might have been the wrong thing to do. I should have thrown it in reverse. Thanks for hanging out that tier one gift sub, my guy. Much obliged. Alright. Waiting for the splashes. Waiting for splashes. Alright. They're a little deeper than we are, but they're pretty close. Damage control up. This one's bad. Oh, we made it. We made it. Four knots. Start steering me to starboard. It's going overhead. Faster. Turn harder. Straighten us out. Try to run. Oh! <laughs> They're colliding! <laughs> ah! They're colliding! That depth charge looks like the killer right there. Get out of the friggin' way, map. Oh! Currently no damage. <sighs> Flooding! Flooding forward! Lower the depth. Or sorry, decrease the depth, rather. 190 feet. Can I click on my ship yet? There it is. How we doing, folks? Oh, flooding to the rear and the forward. Those sections are lost to sea. Understood. Um, where's my depth? Are any of these my depth? Speed? We're sinking. We're dead. We're dead. Yeah, that sucks. Okay. The Tau Tog. Destroyed. Destroyed. Kinda saw that coming. I really don't know how you're meant to outrun things yet, so, uh... Is what it is, I suppose. Uh, retreat. Leave. Confirm. We lost the Tau Tog. 2,370 tons.